Dear viewers, greetings. This present video is about the various shapes and arrangement of bacteria. And currently, uh, nearly nine different bacterial shapes were identified. Uh, they are uh, caucus, that is spherical shaped, bacillus, rod shaped, uh, curved or comma shaped bacteria, spiral shaped or twisted bacteria, filamentous bacteria, both shaped bacteria, appendaged bacteria, uh, star shaped bacteria and the pleomorphic bacteria and bacteria are available in different uh, shapes and the first shape is a uh, caucus shape that is a spherical shape under the caucus uh, shape nearly uh, six type of arrangements are available uh, they are diplococci uh, diplococcic encapsulated uh, staphylococci streptococci sarsina tetra the diplococci represents the arrangement of uh, two cocci, that is the pair of cocci is represented as diplococci. And the pair of cocci surrounded with the capsule is represented as uh, diplococci encapsulated. The cluster of cocci is referred as staphylococcus. And the cocci arranged in the form of chain is called as streptococci. Arrangement of uh, four cocci is referred as tetra. And arrangement of eight cocci is referred as sarsina. And regarding the arrangement, uh, cocci are available in six different arrangements. And the first one is the diplococcus. That is the cocci arranged in form of pair is referred as the diplococci or diplococcus. The examples for the diplococcus are enterococcus species and Neisseria oneria. And the second type of arrangement is encapsulated diplococcus. That is the cocci arranged in the form of pairs or surrounded with capsule is referred as encapsulated diplococcus. And the example for this encapsulated diplococcus is streptococcus pneumoniae, which is widely uh, well known as meridian streptococcus. And the third one is the streptococcus. That is the cocci arranged in form of chains or called as streptococcus. And the examples include the streptococcus pyogens and streptococcus mutants. And the fourth type of uh, cocci arrangement is uh, tetrox. That is the cocci arranged in packets of four cells and the cells divided in two planes is referred as uh, tetrox. The examples of the tetrox are pediococcus species and the tetragenococcus species. And the fifth type of arrangement is uh, sarsini. It represents the cocci arranged in packets of eight cells that is the that, that sarsinia bacteria will look like the cuboid shape and the cell divides in three planes the example for the sarsinia is the sarsinia species and the final type of arrangement is the staphylococcus that is the cocci arranged in form of grape like cluster is called as the staphylococcus are a type of arrangement and the example for this arrangement is the staphylococcus aureus uh, staphylococcus epidermis etc and next to bacterial shape is uh, rod shaped bacteria that is uh, widely referred as the bacillus. Regarding the arrangement, they are available in various arrangements like uh, cocobacillus, diplobacilli, phallicids or Chinese letter appearance, uh, streptobacilli, like that. And nearly five types of arrangements are kind of available for this bacilli. The first type of arrangement is diplobacilli, that is the bacilli arranged in pairs or referred as the diplobacilli. So some of the examples for the diplobacilli are Cotsella burnetti, Borazella bovis, and Klebsiella rhinoscleromatis. These are the examples for diplobacilli. And next to the type of arrangement is the streptobacilli, that is, bacilli arranged in form of chains or referred as the streptobacilli. And some examples for the streptobacilli are Streptobacillus monoliformis, Streptobacillus felis, and Streptobacillus hongkongensis. And the third type of arrangement of uh, bacilli is trichomes that is the bacillus arranged in chains with larger area of NP in contact between the cell is called as trichomes the very well known example for the trichomes is the photosynthetic cyanobacteria the fourth type of arrangement of bacilli is the phallicids that is the bacillus resembling the picket fence uh, type of arrangement or Chinese letter arrangement is referred as uh, phallicids. The very well known example for this phallicids are uh, 
common bacterium diphtheria, uh, which is widely known as uh, the costive agent for the diphtherial disease. And the coco bacilli, they are short, stumpy, and ovoid in shape. And uh, that its shape looks like both coccus and bacillus. So they are named as the coco bacillus. And the example for this coco bacilli are Haemophilus influenzae, Gardnerella vaginalis, and uh, Chlamydia trachomatis. And the next type of uh, bacterial shape is the curved shaped bacteria or comma shaped bacteria. They are widely referred as uh, vibrios. The vibrios are the comma shaped or curve shaped bacilli. And the examples for this vibrio are vibrio cholerae, vibrio parahemolyticus, and dello vibrio species. These three are the examples for the comma shaped bacteria. The next step is the spiral shape or twisted shaped bacteria. And they are rod shaped bacteria which have more than one twist in the cell or referred as the spiral or twisted shaped bacteria. And the, some of the very well known examples of the spiral shaped bacteria are spirochetes, and that is very well known for sexually transmitted diseases. And the bacteria includes the Triponema pallidum, Leptospira species, and Borrelia species. The next arrangement is sorry, the next shape is the filamentous bacteria. They are very long, thin filamentous shaped bacteria and they form branching filaments which are resulting in the appearance of uh, mycelium, which is very well known in fungi like this. Uh, the example is the Candidatus savagella is an example for the filamentous bacteria. Next is the box shaped bacteria and this type of uh, bacteria looks like the box shape or rectangular shaped. And the smaller cells are usually square in shape that is uh, 2 into 2 micron uh, size and the larger cells are rectangular in shape and about uh, uh, very wide and 4 into 2 micron in size. The appendaged bacteria they, they present the extension of the cells as long tubes in the form of stalk or hyphae or as buds. They are referred as the appendaged bacteria. And this is the star shaped bacteria and this bacteria looks like stars. And finally the pleomorphic bacteria. The pleomorphic bacteria are the bacteria which do not have any characteristic shape and they are able to change their shape as per their wish. The in pure culture, they can be observed uh, to be, have their different shapes. And the example for this pleomorphic bacteria is uh, Mycoplasma species, particularly the Mycoplasma pneumoniae, Mycopa Mycoplasma genitalium, etc. Thank you for listening and thank you for your support. Thank you.